500 kids erupt in applause yesterday. And I was so surprised. We just looked at some stats as to what has happened to the loneliness rates for young people since the iPhone was invented in 2007. Thanks to Gene Twenge's research in the book iGen. So 500 kids erupting in applause and in, in the back of my head I'm thinking, what the hell are they cheering for? I was a bit torn up. Are they cheering because they're lonely? Or I don't, I didn't get it. So I asked them again, they cheered again and I, I had to stop and I said, oh, can we just talk about this for a minute? Um, so when we did, they said they were cheering out of acknowledgement of their collective loneliness. So it was a beautiful moment of acknowledgement. It was a beautiful moment of naming the collective suffering that was going on. And I was really impressed that they, <laughs> they were that astute and aware that this was really a serious problem for them. We know it's not just a problem for young people. We know um, that this super computer little pocket device um, has a lot of bad tendencies to it. Not saying it's all bad, um, but we need to start addressing it. Our addictions to the device and to social media, um, they really are impacting us in negative ways. So how can we use our agency and our self-awareness to start having healthier relationships um, to these things? Which is a lot of the work that we do uh, is helping people connect to themselves and to others without the use of technology. Um, because technology and apps and whatever, it's not a solution to this collective existential mental health crisis that's going on. It is not a solution. I don't care what kind of justification and rationalization and, uh, that people come up with. It's not a solution. We need interpersonal communication and connection. And we also need to be able to do that personally ourselves, connect to ourselves and understand what the heck is going on. So I wanted to share that really profound moment. Um, it was beautiful and I was deeply touched by it. Um, and we ended up having a really wonderful conversation about it. So I hope you're all well. Take care. Peace.